So everyone's been asking me when the Zodiac video is going to come out, but the thing is, it's going to take a lot of work, right? It would take too long in between uploads. So I wanted to try to get out a shorter video so that uh, I could upload something for you guys because the Zodiac video is going to be good, but it's going to take a long time. It's going to take a very long time. The Silent Club Step race has been kind of heating up lately and it's got me kind of interested. I just want to kind of experience it for myself a bit and play through it. I, I kind of want to see what they're playing, you know what I mean? Like kind of get an understanding of how it all is. So we are going to do runs on Silent Club Step. I don't know how it's going to go. Okay, Silent Club Step. The one, the only. Only. Also, just so everyone knows, I am on 360 now. I am cheating officially, playing like a real top player now. Okay, so this is the hardest part of level, I think. I'm pretty sure it's like impossible, this ship. I have a feeling I'm gonna spend a lot of time at this duel today. For like two hours, probably gonna <laughs> spend at this one duel. Okay, here we are. Final destination. Do you get it? I don't really get the appeal of these jumps. I know they're like, they have like this big like history or whatever, but they're just, they're just, I don't know. I just see them as a bunch of jumps. Maybe that's like disrespectful to the eight jumps of hell, but I don't know. Someone's gotta tell me the code in chat. I'm not looking for it myself. Somehow I don't I think it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Again? Why? I just. Ugh. Finally, dude, I passed the stupid ass part. Impossible. Hardest thing ever. Well, that's okay. It's not a problem we're gonna have to deal with for a little while because I'm playing the pre drop, baby. I gotta do the ship. I have to do the ship. No, what the. Whoa! Whoa! Really? That's not happening again. One in 10,000 random world chance thing. Am I joining the race to beat this? No. I was going to at some point, but honestly, I don't even want to. Like, I don't want them to do it. Not that I think I even could beat them, but like, I might beat it at some point, maybe. We're gonna try to get to 11%. I don't know if we can do it. Nice. Making moves, making moves. It goes 57. I mean, if I get to 57 from the beginning, you guys better be saying go. If I'm at 57, I, I expect to see more than just people saying go. I'm gonna look at chat and everyone's gonna be like having like a seizure. Everyone's jaw, including mine, would just be on the floor the whole attempt. Past like 15%. <laughs> Damn it, eight! I just messed up the transition. Oh my God. Can I do nine? Okay, chat. Knowing what you know about this, do you really think I'm gonna get nine anytime soon? I don't think that's a real option for us. Damn it, oh! Bro, yesterday I literally spent an hour, an hour, like an actual hour in the Wendy's drive-thru. Ridiculous, I was losing my mind. So, because like where I am, everywhere closes at like 9 p.m. Like actually by 9 p.m. Every food place is closed. There's nowhere else to go except for this one Wendy's that has drive-thru up until like 1 a.m. And I was eating really late. I was eating at like midnight. I get in line and there's like a few cars ahead of me, but not many. So I thought I was gonna be fine. And then I got in and no one was moving. It was not moving at all. And I, I didn't understand what was happening. And it was it was really irritating because when I finally go to pay, everyone in there is just like partying, by the way. That's why it took so long. I literally pull up to pay and everyone in the back is like, hey, hey, hey. And they're doing like all this. And I'm like, this is why I waited 30 minutes at the goddamn. I was waiting at like, you know, the voice box where you give your order. I was just sitting there for 30 minutes like, hello. And I was getting no response. And then randomly after 30 minutes, it's like, hey, how can I help you? And I finally pull up and they're literally partying, listening to music. They're I have no problem with people like hanging out during their job, but you also have to do your job a bit, right? Let me just, this, this one's going to really blow your mind. They got my order wrong. One hour waiting in this line and they messed up my order. I was losing my mind, dude. I was so <laughs> mad last night. It, ru it ruined my whole night, bro. I got home and everything I was mad at. Tiny little thing happened, worst thing ever. Like, I, I, you know, it was like one of those sort of moods. I should have known, dude. When I asked for like ketchup packets, I got no response and then t was told how much it would cost me. And then also didn't get ketchup packets. <laughs> and then dude, I get to the counter and she just hands me a drink I didn't order. That's the first thing she does when I get to the counter. She can say, hey, me this random like peach lemony thing that I have nothing to do with. Like I, I, the, the words didn't even come out of my mouth. Yeah, like an actual randomly generated drive through Dealing with like customers and stuff like that is annoying. I, I don't blame you for not being sober, but you have to be conscious. You know what I mean? Like there's a difference. Dude, Chick-fil-A is S tier. I wish they didn't hate gay people. Like, I don't know what their problem is. It sucks, dude. Their peach milkshake is so good. The special ingredient. What, homophobia? Is that the special ingredient? Racism tastes awesome. Have you ever eaten in the South, dude? Everywhere you eat in the South is fantastic. They definitely put some racism in there, bro. So I did some thinking. Let's move on because it's 6.42 p.m. and I don't feel like playing this ship anymore. Thoughts? Maybe I'll come back to it at another point. 
That part is not so bad. That part is not so bad. In terms of pre-drop stuff, this is by far the easiest part. Dude, 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 dude. I was in a bridge call. Someone claimed to jitter 17, and then they jittered 17 on a not broken mouse. Like, I watched their hands do it, and I just have to say, why not me, God? Why can't I do that? You know what I mean? Like, why can't I jitter 17? You have to work for it? No! No, 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 no. I don't want to hear this right now. There is no working for it. The highest I've ever reached is 13. I will not jitter above 13 ever. Yeah, I don't know. I bet, I bet it was definitely the latter. I guarantee this just, just happened to be possible. He was drunk when he made most of it? What? This was like seven years ago. How old was, how old is he? First underage drinking top one. You sure about Tartarus? I would not be surprised if some of that was made under the influence, bro. Silent Akbar. Yeah, literally. I, I don't know. I think they were under the influence of something. I'm just saying, dude, when shrooms inevitably become legal in more places, we're going to see some interesting levels pop up. Dude, I holy fumble, like actually holy fumble, bro. I could I could have at least tried the second half. Okay, new plan. I'm going to revisit the pre-drop tomorrow. I want to see if I can get it in one or two runs. Like, I think I genuinely can. I'm just itching to play something else right now. If I beat Deadlock first try, I'll give 30 subs. Are you sure about that idea? I would not recommend that one. Dude, do I even remember how to play Deadlock? I'll try it, I'll try it. I have not played this level in so long. I don't even remember this right now. It really does not look good, guys. I'll just tell you that right now. For like the ending part, there's no way. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. I don't, I have no clue. Oh, remembering. Let's go, dude. That was actually so hype. I had no idea how to do that part at all. All right, give 30. I'm actually really surprised. I thought I was definitely gonna die to the ending thing because I, I did not know what I was doing. I went all the way out of my way to be deadlocked and no 30 subs. Like, I'm pretty sure that's worth $150. It is a shame. I hope one day to play Mania again, but anytime soon. Ooh. No. Finally passed the ship just to do that. Yeah, cool ball attempt. Really, really genius stuff going on over here. Let's go. Nice. Nice. Okay. Thumbs up. We did the run I was trying to do. Okay. Now I'm going to do that ship to the duel. Wait, I already did that, I think. Okay. That's a good place to leave it for today. Tomorrow, my main goals are try to do the pre-drop in two runs. I want to try to do the duel to the end. Not AIDS. I don't have any STDs. I don't think I'll ever have any STDs, yeah? That sounds pretty impossible. So the reason I even really want to bring this up, and we're, we're going to get heavy instantly, is because of, because of what happened to Technoblade. And I've been thinking these past couple days about like, you know, the impacts I have on people and stuff like that. And because my health hasn't been doing that good, I feel like I should talk about it. I'm not in a good place. I don't know when it's going to get better. And I don't, I, I just want you guys to know what's really going on. You know what I mean? I don't want you guys to be scared because I, I can't really tell you what my activity is going to look like. I had to drop out of college third semester or so because I, I couldn't read the text anymore, which was really concerning to me. So I've been spending the, the last year trying to figure out what's so wrong with me. And I finally figured it out. And it's something that usually wouldn't explain any of this, but it actually does. And I'll explain why in a second. So this year I found out that I'm actually autistic. I have autism and which didn't seem like that big of a deal. But then I, I thought about it in a deeper way. I have a lot of problems with all of my senses. My vision is not good. I get overloaded easily if there's lots of noises around me. I don't have a sense of smell. I don't like people touching me. I should have seen it earlier. I was a very gifted child, like extraordinarily gifted. The thing is my eyes were fine. I do have astigmatism and that's the problem because I have these sensory issues. Uh, when I started developing this more mild astigmatism than I thought, cause when I, when I got my astigmatism checked, it wasn't that bad. It's because of my sensory issues. It amplifies it to an extreme degree. My astigmatism is way worse than it would be otherwise. Unfortunately, there's not a lot I can do about it. You know, there's no, there's no cure for autism and, and my, my astigmatism isn't severe enough to get corrected like that doctors are not even sure if it would even do anything at this point which is really unfortunate because i can't really read text very well anymore and it's really kind of embarrassing for me because i don't think of myself as a stupid person but sitting there like trying to do homework for 10 hours just struggling to get through the google doc it was really demeaning yeah i mean i i, I used to just kind of sit there and wonder like why why am i having to deal with this you know what i mean like what, what's wrong with me and knowing what's wrong with me is sort of a, a weight off my shoulders actually figuring out what is wrong with me now i know but at the same time that's all i can do 
no, there's not a whole lot I can do about this. My mental health just isn't great, as you could probably imagine from the whole thing. So if you see me uh, not around as much sometimes, it's probably because of that. But unfortunately, there's only so much I can do. And that, that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. I am okay. I'm not going to die. Done. Did it. Easy, it's like ripping a band-aid. We can play Silent Club Step now. Okay, so I would like to get the pre-drop and more runs, but I think we should probably prioritize doing... I want to try to do the duel to the end. There's no way I don't choke the last cube. Vision did beat the level backwards. Technically, what Vision did is infinitely harder than beating Silent Club Step, but only if he did it intentionally, which he didn't. Like, he had no he had no nerves. Like, imagine, like, if that was just how the level was. There's no way that would ever get beaten. No one would ever do the 9% ship after all that, like, if they knew. I feel like these jumps become infinitely easier if it actually matters to any degree. I don't know why. I've always kind of felt the way about like timings. Timings are so easy to sweat, I feel like. Like you could really get in the zone with timings. So I found a play that good by the way today because I literally was, I was woken up in the middle of my sleep. Some guy was like banging on my door. I go and open it. It's like, you have to move your car out of the lot. We're repaving it. And they got really mad at me. Except I just never heard about this ever. Like I never got an email. Like I checked my email. There was no email about this whatsoever at all. And then he was like yelling at me like, why are you being so clever? And I was, I was, I was literally, it was like an hour and a half after I slept, so I was just entering REM sleep, and then someone was banging on my door as I was going in there, and then he was the one getting mad at me, bro. That was so annoying, and then I, and then I didn't fall asleep for another like hour. He had some issues that day, you know what I mean? The way he was hitting that door, bro, I think he was trying to break it open, bro. Finally, I don't know why I couldn't do that. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one. No! Did I actually go 14 that time? I was trying to go 15, but I noticed that I counted six, so I tried to count 14. But I think that was actually 14. To me, it's just randomized. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five. Sick. Okay, now it's time to get real. Doing this duel might be the whole run. I, I don't know. <laughs> we'll, we'll see. This is ultimate click pattern zone. Yeah, the world if I do four clicks. Like, it's, it's so difficult, guys. I cannot stress how hard this is. Like, you really just gotta play it over and over again. Oh! Guys, you would not believe what just happened. Actually, I just did four clicks of the duel. Oh my god. Yeah, this is like the hardest duel of all time, and it's so simple. Like, it's insane. Like, how was this made? All right, it was made while being drunk. What? 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 <laughs> That's never happening ever again. I, I, I still messed it up. It was third day. Tried 24 to 100. I just keep adding days until I just beat the level. I upload a day with Silent Club stuff, and it's just like actually been four months and I just beat the level. Just one more day, guys. I just want to play one more day of this real quick. I promise. This, this is the last one. I just want to see if I can get this right in. You dream where you're in a water park, but the water park is a fully fledged Metroidvania. That's like a fantasy right there. That sounds fantastic. Metroidvania water park? Like, that sounds like one of the coolest things ever, right? Okay, guys, you need to make me very rich, like extraordinarily rich, and then we need need to like rent out like an island or something for this, right? How to be a Metroidvania? How can you like unlock new areas or something? If you go down certain slides, maybe you get like special wristbands that allow you to access like more intense slides in other areas that get you to other wristbands that allow like something crazy like that. I'm loving thinking about this right now. Holy crap! This is why I haven't done this duel yet because I'm sitting here thinking. Imagine if there was a Metroidvania water park, IRL speed run of the Metroidvania water. Park. Dude, imagine if it's like a hidden slide that takes you to like a special area or something like that that like allows you to skip some of it or something like that. Or maybe there's like a slide where like there's like two ways and one way is like way harder to go than the other way or something like that. And you have to like somehow get over there. And you fire exits though, but that's like reality. We need to make this happen. You didn't know the dream was hype. That's a shame, dude. You ever been in a dream that's like the coolest thing ever, but like you're like, uh, oh, this is normal. Dude, why hasn't anyone made this? I would go the pest of viewer field trip or going to the Metroidvania water park. I love this idea. I'm so distracted by this idea right now it's you would not believe how distracted i am by this idea it'd be like a wristband that like stores the amount of money you have and stuff like that and you can like scan on certain things to like collect money and stuff like that if any of my viewers happen to be in the oil industry or anything that has you making millions of dollars contact me we, we have some planning to do yeah you eventually gotta get to the point where you're like you can see the entire park and you gotta go on like the most metal water slide that has ever existed it's definitely like like a drop slide you know what i mean dude credit slide like after the big one there's like a really slow slide like where they're like very slowly going through a thing should there be like a really slow like lazy river at the end <laughs> like the credit slide 
Why can't this be real? I'm playing Silent Club Step. This idea is it set me for like 30 minutes. Everyone needs to have a lucid dream about this, like right now. I should have switched up my entire major to make this one thing happen. Mom, dad. I've decided a new career path. Dude, there's gotta be an OST. There has to be an OST. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, areas have to have different themes. Okay, I think I'm gonna be done. <laughs> I didn't even do the duel, but I, I don't know. I'm, I'm just, like, done. We did pretty much the whole duel. It's fine. I'll just let Doggy figure out how many runs there are. I don't, I don't even know. There's probably, like, a million. I don't know if I'm doing a day three. I think I'm just gonna leave it. <laughs>are going to try to clean up the runs we did my plan is we're dropping two runs drop them good with and then i want to try to do either the duel to the end or at least just the duel and then we'll have it all clean so i'm actually i'm actually apartment hunting because i want to I'm, I'm, I'm going to a new a new area i saw something insane when i was out there uh by the way because i was like i ate lunch which by the way like what well, i actually eat three meals in a day like i've never done that before like it was insane to me like i don't know that's never happened before i never woken up that early and I went to this like random like little like sub place, you know what I mean? First of all, I ordered a whole sandwich because I was kind of hungry. But apparently, what they meant by whole was just two sandwiches. Like I I order uh, I got, there was like a corned beef sandwich I was interested in getting. I ordered it and they bring it out and it's literally two separate sandwiches. Like it is actually like that's, how is that a whole? That's a double. But <laughs> while I was there in the the sandwich place, I saw something just insane. Um, this is one of those things you're gonna hear me say and you're just not gonna believe me. But this happened. Someone walked in. Uh, I don't I don't want to be like rude, but he was like. He was like 400 pounds or stuff like he was really big and his shirt just said hard to kidnap he went up to the cashier and was like i would like a single slice of cheese i'm serious and he was given a single slice of cheese and then he walked out i, I don't know it's literally something that happens in a dream so go me i guess Fumble the bag, dude! Dude, what? So lucky! Oh my god! I thought I was gonna fumble that so hard. I I I fumbled no bags, bro. Dude, I did that run in like two seconds, dude. What? All right, so food drop in three runs now. I just have to do the ship from the beginning, and then I have it in two runs. Bro, this is so monotonous. I'm about to do something else. I see why people did like nine to a hundred. This is like the most boring run ever. I might just move on, guys. Who dropped in three runs? Not two, but also I just can't, can't be asked. The last thing we have to do in order to wrap up this video is we just have to do this duel. I'm about to be 20 in like 13 days, y'all. My end is soon. If this can get raided, so can I. Okay. Imagine if Rob Top raided you and you just started glowing. Just catch on fire. <laughs> what happened to him? He got raided epic meme stretcher. What happens if you get raided auto? I have no idea. Turn it a robot your ass better hope you get rated normal you don't want to be nothing else you don't want to get rated insane you look so goofy getting rated hard wouldn't be very good either because you're just like this all the time you know like what like what is that what kind of expression is that why do i look to my right every time i die what do you think what's your best guess use your critical thinking skills here yeah there's an intruder in my apartment i keep looking at him to make sure it doesn't do anything it's my death animation i really need to do this and i'm, I'm worried it's just not happening like I, I don't know i just can't i could easily do it if i just like sleep and then do it tomorrow but i i really just want to finish this video right now but it's just like i literally am not gonna get any better playing this like I'm, i i can't it just doesn't work like that you don't get better while actually playing the game that's not it's just not how it works improving the gd's a scam you literally only do it while you're asleep half the time it feels like playing when you're actually conscious is just useless because you're just gonna wake up the next day and do better this is literally all i had to do and i couldn't do it we got some good runs done in total now that we're done
As for the level itself, it's garbage, but I guess I come to surprise to no one. Uh, obviously, GG to Paco for verifying. Probably one of the most polarizing top fives we're gonna ever have. Okay, I'll see you guys. Take care.